Hi, I'm Nick with SVS here with our Director of Technology, Ed Mullen. How's it going, Ed? Good, Nick. Thanks. I'm going to talk about another topic uh, around subwoofers today that uh, I know you speak to very often, and uh, it's the, uh, the comparison between sealed and ported subwoofers. What, what's the advantage to having a sealed subwoofer in terms of cabinet? Well, one of the obvious advantages of a sealed subwoofer is they typically are considerably smaller than their ported counterparts, so they fit into the room more easily, they have less visual impact and, and easier integration into the decor. So that's, that's one of the primary benefits of, a, of our sealed subwoofers, is size. So when you're, you're talking about the actual output, what can people expect from a, from a sealed cabinet subwoofer? Well, the sealed subwoofer tends to have excellent sound quality. and By that I mean good detail, articulation, tightness, speed, transient response. Those are all sort of hallmarks of a, the sealed subwoofer design. So transient response, that's, that's a term that people may not be familiar with. What's a, what's a more detailed explanation of, uh, of what that means? It's the ability of the subwoofer to stop and start with the music transients and not have any overhang or sloppiness uh, to the bass. So a lot of times a, a subwoofer without great transient response might blur some of the notes together. It might distort what you're supposed to be hearing from a, an artistic standpoint and, and sort of put its own signature into that's it. That's exactly right. A properly designed sealed subwoofer will have that sort of stop on a dime bass that uh, enthusiasts and music aficionados really appreciate. So you're talking about speed and transients and musicality here. Uh, there's a notion out there that, that maybe sealed subwoofers uh, don't work as well for home theater. Is that true and, and what can you say about that? Well, it's actually not true. A sealed subwoofer can provide you with a, a no compromise listening experience even on home theater, provided that the room size and the playback level are, is consistent with the output capabilities of the sealed subwoofer. So along those lines, obviously ported subwoofers tend to be hailed as great for home theater. Um, why is that? What exactly about a ported subwoofer makes it great for, uh, for big home theater experiences? Right. Uh, the ported subwoofer, say we're looking at something in the same price point, sealed subwoofer versus ported. The ported subwoofer will have higher output capability, particularly in the, in the deeper octave, say 20 to 40 hertz. That's the octave where LFE effects tend to be strong on action and sci-fi movies. The ported subwoofer will have sometimes two, three, even four times higher output capability than the sealed counterpart in that deeper octave. So the ported subwoofer can be a good choice for action and sci-fi movies in a larger room at a higher playback level because it has just more sheer output capability. So you're talking lower and louder, especially at those lower frequencies, great for big action scenes and really emphasizing the bass when, uh, when you need it most. Right, and again, in a bigger room at a higher playback level where you might exceed the limitations of a sealed subwoofer, the ported subwoofer will have that additional slam impact and pressure for more exciting effects on LFE. So when you're talking about cabinet design, what, what about the ported subwoofer makes it special or what, what should people understand? Well, the ported subwoofer, in order to get that additional output capability in the deeper octave, will typically be much larger than the sealed subwoofer. So that's something you're going to have to contend with in terms of either footprint or height uh, with respect to lifestyle considerations and, and, and visual impact and decor integration. So prepare for that if you want to get the performance of the ported subwoofer down low you need to accommodate for it in your room. And what role are the actual ports playing in the subwoofer that allow them to sort of dig a little deeper and play a little louder? Well the two things that give the ported subwoofer higher output capability at the deepest frequencies, one is the cabinet volume which just improves sensitivity and, and output at the deepest frequencies and the port itself actually will will damp woofer motion at the deepest frequencies around the tuning frequency of the port and the port itself actually contributes output uh, when the woofer is not moving very much. So when you're talking about how that ported design affects the performance, uh, what would you say in terms of a, a ported subwoofer working for music and, and, and some of the, uh, the quicker things that we were talking about with sealed? Well there's a sort of a myth out there that ported subs are, are terrible for music and, and in some cases that's true. A lot of ported subs that are small and have a high tuning frequency can sound sort of slow and plodding on music. Our ported subwoofers have a much deeper tuning frequency, so the effects of the port on music are minimized. So our ported subwoofers tend to behave a lot like sealed subwoofers over the music bandwidth. So our ported subwoofers can actually sound quite good on music. If you're looking for some of that, maybe a, a, an all-around subwoofer that works great for home theater in a large room, and you want really good performance on music, ported can be a good choice if, if you can fit it into the room. So it sounds like there's a grain of truth to the notion that sealed is better for music, ported is better for home theater, but 
it behooves you to look a little deeper and, and maybe talk to somebody who, who can give specific recommendations about a subwoofer relative to your room size and some other factors. Exactly. Again, remember that a sealed subwoofer can give you a no compromise experience for music and home theater, provided the room size and the playback level is consistent with the limits of that subwoofer. And, and ported can also give you an excellent music experience. If you want more information about ported versus sealed subwoofers, check out our site at svsound.com. And if you have specific questions, contact our customer service team, email, chat, or phone, and we'd be happy to help you out with system optimization. Thanks.